If you're prone to believe in conspiracies, you're going to love today's Bible reading. Because in 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, Paul reveals not a conspiracy theory, but a very real conspiracy that's happening in secret in our world today. It's a conspiracy theorist's dream come true. Paul begins, Now, dear brothers and sisters, let us clarify some things about the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ and how we will be gathered to meet him. See, there were those in Thessalonica who were spreading false information that the day of the Lord had already begun. They claimed to have had a spiritual vision or revelation, even a letter from the Apostle Paul himself saying this. And to clarify, Paul says three things very emphatically. Don't be so easily shaken, don't believe them, and don't be fooled. For the day of the Lord will not come until there's this great rebellion against God, and the man of lawlessness, the Antichrist, is revealed. Paul went on to say that this man, the Antichrist, is being held back until a very specific time. For this lawlessness, verse 7 says, is already at work in secret, and it will remain secret until the one who is holding it back steps out of the way. Then and only then will he and his conspiracy be revealed. Paul wanted the Thessalonian church to know, and I believe the Spirit wants the global church to know today, that he is still in control. God is sovereign over all things, and nothing can happen, not even the hidden spiritual things, without his knowledge and his consent. Is there really a conspiracy going on under the spiritual radar today? You bet there is. But God knows the things that are done in secret. He's in complete control. And God himself is standing in the way of this monumental event until everything is in place and his time has come. Even so, the church says, come quickly, Lord Jesus, as we live in great expectation of his soon return. 2 Thessalonians chapter 2 ends with a beautiful blessing. So let me encourage you, get your Bible out, read chapter 2, and enjoy God's blessing in your life today.